Welcome to this short and quick video on how to set up an FTP connection to your server. When you're building and managing websites, knowing how to set up an FTP connection is going to be very useful to you very often. So let's get started right away. The first thing you need to do is I recommend you download FileZilla. FileZilla is the FTP client that we're going to use. You simply go to FileZilla-project.org and I'll put a link to that below the video and you click on this download client button and you choose the file according to your operating system. So you've got Mac OS X, Linux and Windows. So in my case, I'd click on this Windows installation file. This starts a download. I download that file and I'd run the installation, which just takes a few clicks and following the installation wizard. So I'm not going to demonstrate that uh, because I'm sure you know how to do that. So once you've done that, you've got this program here installed. What we're going to do here is we're going to connect this up to your server so that you can access the files on your server on your hosting account as if it was on a hard drive of your own. So over here you see the hard drives listed, uh, the local hard drives, and over here we'll see the server files listed. So let's set that up right away. The first thing to do is I click on this icon here to open the site manager and I click on new site. So I want to add a new site and now I need to get the data to fill in here. To get this data, I need to go to my cPanel. And if you're wondering how do I get here, watch the first video on how to set up a site from scratch. So this will be your hosting account login. I'm going to type in FTP in this finder field, and this leaves me with very few options. The right one that I'm looking for is FTP accounts. Now, for any domain and any add on domain you'd add to your hosting account, you'll have a standard. Uh, access FTP account. You can also create new ones if you want to, but it, because you're the admin and the owner, you can use this standard account to access all of the files on your server. Now click on configure FTP client and this will show you some info. You can also download a configuration file for FileZilla. Unfortunately, I found that that usually doesn't work. So we're going to configure this manually and the first thing you need is this FTP server name. I'm going to copy that. I'm just going to select it and copy it over to FileZilla and type that in as the host name. Then I'll change the connection type here to normal and I'll go back in here and get the username, copy that, put that in as user and the password is going to be the same password I use to log into my cPanel account. Okay, so that same password, I'm going to put that in here and I'm going to click OK. So now I have this site listed here. It's listed as a new site. I'm going to click on this and it'll establish a connection. This is, has happened right now. And down here you can see the files listed on my hosting account. You'll see all the files listed up here so I can open this up. And in the case of a HostGator hosted account, these names can be different, but on HostGator, the website files will be in public HTML. So I can open this up. And these three folders here, WP Admin, Content and Includes, are the WordPress files. And usually when you want to upload a new set of files, you'll do so in the WP Content folder. And I can click on, let's say, the Plugins folder, and the content of that folder will be listed down here. Whenever I need to upload a new file or download a file from my server, I can simply do so by dragging and dropping. So I can simply grab a file from here, drop it onto the folder or um, directory that I want to save it on and the other way around as well. So I can I can grab a folder or a file from here, drag it over here to install it or upload it to my server. Then when you're done working on this, you can click on this icon here to disconnect again. And I think that's about all you need to know for setting up an FTP connection to your hosting account.